Alright guys, welcome back. This is Mr. Xbox it. Do have a nice well, I should say better setup than we did last time. So you can see the controller's laid out and I'm not holding the camera. Which is really nice for me, I'm not gonna lie. But anyway, I'll just run you through what I did for this controller. It is a silvery chrome. It's not like chrome chrome like you see on professionals, how they have the crazy shine off there, but it does give some reflection. Turned out really nice. We got that blue metallic splatter back, and also I will uh, zoom in a little bit for you guys, and you can see I do have blue flakes in there. That turned out really nice. But I do have the chrome ABXY buttons, chrome guy button, chrome D pad. Uh, we got start and select or the regular white. I haven't painted those yet. Blue thumbsticks. Those are really cool and nice. Flip it up here. The trim is chrome with blue splatter. There we go. Alright, flip it over. Same thing on the back. I'll try to get in. You guys to see those blue flakes, they actually look really nice in person. I'm not gonna lie. If I flip it up on the top, we do have chrome triggers. This is that blue metallic uh, bumper. This middle piece, though, is from my other controller. Um, I had I'm painting the chrome one right now, but I really wanted to get uh, a video on this because it, it looks really, really nice. Not gonna lie, I actually really liked the, how I, this one finished. So I do have that in there, and the sync button's gone, as you can probably see. There's a giant hole there because I took it off. Um. Yeah, this one turned out really nice, just like my other ones. Well, my other one, I should say. <laughs> and uh, for this one, I did have to use a different type of clear coat because uh, the clear, the duplicolor clear coat is well for for silver. It turns it into a gray, and I don't know why it does this, but. I found that out, so I just redo it, sand it down, everything, and uh, I redid it, and you can see it's a lot shinier and nicer. I did use a different type of clear coat that worked a lot better. I don't have the bottle next to me, but hopefully I'll put it in the description for you guys. Um, but yeah, this one turned out really nice. I like the way it finished. Feels great, just like my other one. Uh, just run you guys through it a little bit, just show it off a tad bit more. There we go. And also, I'm going to start doing other controllers that aren't going to have the splatter, but I just had a tad bit of blue left, so I thought, why not? Let's splatter one more. Um,. I am now going to run you through a couple of other things uh, that I have just laying around here next to me. So, let me get this out of the way. Got a white D-pad recently. I don't know. I don't remember where I got it from, but I will be putting that on a controller that I'm about to show you in a little bit. Uh, bring in these. These are the ABXY and guide button from my other controller that got that blue metallic it does reflect really nice as well those are out of the way these though these are the pride and joy right here Let's get these out. these are just regular shiny black starting back button but these here abxy blue chrome and guide button those are really reflective. I don't know if you guys can tell or see. Probably see the camera in there. Probably on this one better, but anywho, yeah, they shine really well. Get those out of the way. Regular black thumbsticks. Took those off the uh, other controller. This right here, though. Proud of this. This is carbon fiber battery pack. 
perfectly done. It's on a rechargeable plan charge kit. I don't use AA batteries, and if you do use AA batteries, I suggest you change to this because you're wasting your money. Anywho, carbon fiber. It's really nice. As you can tell, it's not paint. It's really nice feeling. It's crazy. But uh, I'll explain more of that after I show you this next controller. Huzzah! It's upside down. There we go. This is the controller that I use the most, mainly because it's the nicest <laughs> in my case. It does have white analog sticks that are awesome, and surprisingly, they don't get dirty. Like they're like I had spray paint on my fingers from doing the Chrome controller, and they did not go on to these when I was playing Modern Warfare 3. Um, start back or white. This is a glossy white guide button and then we got the white out buttons right there glossy black I will have a gloss I do have a glossy white but not near me and I don't want to waste your time by going to get it flip it on top glossy black bumpers and top piece and then we got white triggers top it off throw this in here so you guys can see that. Looks really nice. I probably will be doing a uh, carbon fiber controller. Just like this. It turned out really cool. And I do not have any LEDs in this, so it's going to turn into a. Uh, oh, missed it. Oh, nice little green. Yay. Everybody hates green. Anywho, let's pull that out. Um. Yeah, so that about wraps it up with controllers, but I'm going to jump back just for about 30 more seconds and talk to you guys about that right there, carbon fiber. So, here's the film. Yeah, I just covered the whole screen. It's really nice film. And I uh, just put that onto the, uh, well that's the back side of the film. Right there. I don't know if you guys know what hydro dipping is, but basically, it's hydro dipped. It's basically where you take film, like so, it's balled up, and uh, you put it in water, you let it soak up, da 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 da, you spray some crap on it, and then you basically just take what you want to dip, and you dip it in, and it basically just adheres right to it so and so and so I'm just giving you the short version so all you critics out there can nag on me and troll on me for getting it wrong and whatnot but your final product does turn out really nice but this is a special type of film so it does have a uh, does have a nice touch to it it is clear coated so it does give it a nice shine and of course it looks great so yeah that's my video get that out of the way about this controller mainly but then I brought in some other crap so uh, we'll see the next controller like I said if you guys have any ones that you want me to do give me colors I just want to give you guys what you want so send me some colors give me some ideas tell me what you want to do I'll do them you guys can comment rate subscribe like um, just do whatever you gotta do, and, uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks, guys.